What's up, YouTube? It's Francesco Palaccia checking in. Monday night, 7 p.m. Uh, the hoodie you guys saw is from this company called Eight Man Strong. I just recently found them on social media and just, you know, looking at their products, looking at their website uh, and all their posts. They're very powerlifting, strength oriented, which is really cool. I don't know if you caught on that letter I was showing you guys. It says lift angry and that's like their, their, uh, their mantra. So I really can relate to that because that's the type of that's how I approach my training. So I'm gonna be getting more gear from them. So I mean, in future videos, you'll probably see a, some t-shirts from them and whatnot. I'm not an affiliate or anything. I don't have a discount code or anything like that. Um, I'm just kind of shouting them out because I think they deserve it. It's a cool company. Um, I'll let you guys know what I think of the hoodie. This is my first time wearing it throughout the commentary on the video, just as a heads up. But uh, today we got shoulders. Um, this is gonna be my first time my second time training since Saturday and on Saturday I checked in with Ryan like I told you guys and he switched up my training not the exercises as much as it is my rep range uh, My rep range went from like 10 to 20 down to 6 to 8 um, so because I'm uh, going heavier with less reps obviously I'm gonna be incorporating a few more sets as well as some drop sets just to you know get the blood flow into the shoulders keep the shoulders nice and full hope you enjoy the video guys please feel free to comment what you think and whatnot and let's lift angry and on another note I totally forgot to tell you guys this but my gym is closing and my gym was considered the meathead gym in our area so I'm pretty upset about that so now me and Ashley tonight are trying out a new gym I got a free week pass to it so we're gonna see how we like it. Um, you know, for me, atmosphere is a big thing when it comes to training. Just because if a gym doesn't have like a competitive atmosphere or just intensity, um, I don't know, I just tend to stay away from those type of gyms. But we'll see how it goes, first time training here. See if we get any weird looks for recording and whatnot. So, wish us luck. All right guys, walking up to this new gym. Pretty decorative plaza. That's nice. Ashley, how are you feeling right now? Horrible, I wanna go back to stack. Gym problems. Let's see what it looks like inside. All right guys, so the first workout that we have for the shoulder workout is uh, seated overhead press. Um, this is a new movement for me. I didn't really focus on this movement at all when I was just on my own or doing Candido. I typically did it standing. However, doing it seated has benefits. I feel it a lot better in my rear delts and I feel like it focuses on my rear delts, which is one of my uh, weak points in my opinion. Uh, for this, you're seeing my drop sets because with the heavier weight, I wanted Ashley there to help me unrack it. But uh, I only let my elbows go to 90 degrees. That's what Ryan recommended. And uh, just keep it nice and clean. One thing I want to mention about this hoodie, guys, it kept me pretty warm throughout the entire warming up. Uh, not warm to the point where I was hot and uncomfortable, but just right. Um, I felt comfortable enough to wear it throughout the whole workout. However, I didn't because this was my only other shirt I had to wear after the workout. But uh, just wanted to throw that little side note in there. Next, we moved on to Arnold presses. Typically, we go higher. We were going higher reps, about 12 reps. So. Going heavier kind of threw me off uh, just because I needed to feel out the weight a bit. But I just pushed until I could only hit six and then from there I would drop down. I think I hit about 55s and then from there I had to drop and just went for more than eight reps after that. Next we moved on to these lateral raises in which you are seeing. Uh, typically I don't go heavy on lateral raises because I feel like it's an a sh a exercise movement for your shoulders that can really hurt you with heavy weight so I typically go high, really high reps with it. However, uh, Ryan told me to go heavier with my training, so I totally trust him. Just kept it six to eight reps. As soon as I couldn't hit six reps, I just did my drop sets down from there. So next we moved on to uh, reverse flies. Um, typically I do one set of 25, then I'll do another set 30 seconds later till failure. However, I just cut this, the 25 in half to kind of keep some good hypertrophy going into my rear delts. So did first set of 12, then I dropped and did a set till failure. Um, one thing I'd like to mention is that I always keep 
I always focus on trying to squeeze my elbows together and make my elbows touch. And it really works not only your rear delts, but it also gets your traps really involved in the movement, which helps bring out your traps from your, like, your rear perspective. Uh, after that, we moved on to dumbbell shrugs. Uh, typically, it's one set, of one set to 25, then three sets, 10 to 12. So I did one set of 12, which is what you're seeing right now. And then I moved on to my three sets of six. I went as heavy as I could this time around. And the one thing I don't like about the gym is that you can't do chalk. So when I tried the 140s, I had no grip left and I just almost dropped the weight on my foot. But uh, that's the workout, guys. Uh, like I'm going to say later, please let me know what you think of the video. Again, I really enjoyed the hoodie. Thought it was a great um, breathable material to wear for your workouts. Thoughts on the gym? The lighting it was really difficult to work with, as you guys probably saw. So it was pretty crowded too. I don't know if we just came at a bad time or something. Don't know how I feel about the gym yet, guys. I'm going to just keep looking, hopefully find something better that I just like absolutely fall in love with. Um, thoughts on this hoodie? Uh, it's steak sauce, guys. Um, I don't know how much I talked about it in the commentary, but the reason why I took it off kind of quick into the workout was because um, this is my only other article of clothing to wear after the gym, so I didn't want to ruin it and be cold. But guys, I loved it. I love this hoodie. Um, super breathable. Uh, felt comfortable the entire time I was wearing it. Um, I definitely recommend it. You should check it out. Ending the video here, guys. Thank you for watching. Please like the video, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. God bless. Next time you see me will be four days out.